three times here. One, two, and three. Who's your uh, partner, Ninja? Yeah, sorry, I was trying to get it. it like, I added both this, but wasn't adding Jessica for some reason. So. Mm -hmm. A lot of black and red in this pot. So somehow worse. I guess I'll, I'll keep this. It feels bad. I don't want to go down and wreck this. You guys know if this is actually for points or is it for fun? I have no idea. I would assume it's for points. Yeah, I think I think it's for points, but I couldn't say. 
I'm I'm all set. Uh, any pregame actions, anyone? Nope. All right. Uh, Arwal. All good to go. All right. I will play this uh, extremely sad gemstone caverns. Uh, and then a lotus petal, and oh, past turn. Oh, forgot to draw the strike again. That's helpful. Does that change anything? No. Nope. Past turn. Okay. Draw. Uh, wow, that's unfortunate. Wait, hold on. I gotta read the other side of something. Yep, answer's tapped. <laughs> um, yeah, I play uh, Haunted Ridge, which answer's tapped. Mana Crypt. And then Chalice of Indulgence off the Mana Crypt. And Emma Tim. You alright? You alright? Play a Windswept Peep. I'll crack that for a Savannah. Um, let's go ahead and shortcut that. Um, play a Chrome Mox. I'll exile an Elder Spirit Guide. And cast Sappy. And I'll pass the turn. Okay. Track turn. Play it. There's the Saga. Colorless, cast a soul ring, tap the soul ring, play a cursed totem, and then I'll I'll pass. Is that one that hits artifacts or creatures? Creatures. Okay. Just creatures. Right. Oh. I play a lot of equipments that would be unplayable in this deck. Yep. Play this ancient tomb. I'll tap three. No, I don't need three. Tap two. I'm taking two off the ancient tomb and exiling a simian spirit guide for a red to cast a bergy god of storytelling. And, and, password. Password. and if that's good, I will uh, end like, my turn. Uh, I'll have to take damage. I'm going to roll even. Don't take damage. Uh, um, we have Agadine tapped. The Under Crypt. Ooh, nice. um, and then I will cast Foltus, the Shadow Cat Familiar. Commanders are control menace and death touch. And he's a 2 2. Gotcha. Um, that's all I got. End my turn. Play an Urza Saga.
Uh, Bergie is a 3-3, three, three, right? Yes, she's a 3-3. Three, three. Okay. I'll go into combat uh, at Turok for two. Got it. And then second main. Gets a recruiter of the guard. And we'll go get... Faster for that. Okay. I'm going to play a land for turn. I'll tap it for a shadow spear. I will play this mountain. I'll also play it LED. How much money do you have? I have <laughs> enough to cast go. Right, but does he have enough to quip right. from the birdie? <clears throat> no, I do not have enough to equip currently. One, two, three, four. Five, six, nine mana. So six of it would be to cast, and I have enough to equip currently. Uh, you would get another mana from casting, uh, Kodo. Yeah, it's five to equip with Helm. So oh, I'm I one short, you. technically. I got you, I got you. I will use one, two, actually two. Play an Imperial Recruiter. Good with that. I pass, Brownie. Okay. I pass. Side extortionist. Well, that'll do it. Dark side in my hand. I will. Two for Dockside. Getting another Bergy. You get two for me. So it's two, three, four, five, six. Is it six, correct? Six, two. Uh, you're missing. Or is it Saga's lands? Maybe eight, yeah. Eight. Eight. Six of them to cast Kodo. Getting a birdie man. Just go to resolve. I pass for Pass for Pass for 
ETB go to. The two Bergy, two treasures, crack lotus petal, and attempt to equip out the host to go there. I pass priority. Pass priority. I pass priority. Good game, boys. Oh, nice. If I didn't have a tap land, you could have stopped that. You didn't pay life, correct? What? Yeah, he you didn't, didn't have himself. Oh, man. Yeah. I didn't know it that wasn't a tap land. Come on, <laughs> oh, fuck me. I could have racked those charms. You're so hard. Yeah. What's racked those charms? Uh, well, all your creatures do one damage right. to you. Yeah. Nice. Or I could have just destroyed the... Um, I was debating how safe I needed to be with it, because I had Twin Flame, so I debated getting just Hammer and Zahn and then Twin Flame and the Goto. Yeah. But, yeah, so Rack and Storm would have killed you either way. Yeah. And then, yeah, all I had was a red elemental blast with no one's playing blue. So. Man, <laughs> I, didn't realize, I, didn't, I, I just saw it comes into the battlefield tapped. I didn't even continue reading after that. Man, that's, this, is my, <laughs> this is my third turn three win with Goto. Yeah, yeah. Go to fucking gas pedals, that's, that's for sure. Nope. One time I don't play blue. Does anyone want to do another one? I'm down. Yeah. No, I gotta yeah. go. Have fun. Grab oh, Aaron, probably. GG's, boys. Yeah. Maybe Nate will want to play. That guy was just like, I'm out of <laughs> I feel yeah. bad winning so fast all the time with Goto, but you know, it's. it's really, yeah, he's, uh, he's, that's kind of my bad. I, I didn't realize yeah. I could actually pay white, but not tap that. Did you have the red mana for it too? Oh, I yeah, guess I you had the, the talisman. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You, know, you got to play to the meta. So, go to wins wins quick if you don't have early stacks or or blue player. Yeah. So, yeah. My turn one hand would have been fire, but I was short mana because I had a treasonous ogre in turn in, in my hand, and I was like a mana off of getting it down turn one. Um. Uh. Yeah, I was a mana away from uh, <clears throat> getting a uh, turn to um, Draneth Magistrate, which is oh, pretty good know, against you. Fuck me. you and... <laughs> yeah. Was that what you were debating getting with Recruiter of the Guard? Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> once, you got, uh, once you got the Rallyer, I thought you were going to be pretty close to winning. Yeah, uh, well, I could have got that, but it would have been a next turn play. It would have right. been with the uh, Alley of Devastation is how to get get it out. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Mm, nice. Yeah, and you got to decide how you, who points-wise. I think last time you did it based off of the current standings of points, and I have no idea how many points anybody has because I haven't seen John post it in, like, forever. Uh, we'll just go turn order then. That's fine. Because say Steven is definitely in the lead. He's won twice, I think, now. Yeah, we can put Steven in. Well, I, I'm probably in the lead now. I, well, I think you, you, even after you, I think. Right. But I'm not going to make myself last. <laughs> right. Uh, we'll just do turn order, so it'll be me, Ninja, <coughs> Mega Man, and then Steven. Cool. Okie dokie, or the turkey. <clears throat> message Nate, see if he wants in. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
I don't play this deck too often because John complains about it a lot. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> I legitimately just like, just seriously just read the first line of text and just didn't keep reading after that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, John doesn't like his stuff dying all the time, so he really hates the cat deck. that quick it was turn three go to again oh well i mean that'll do it <laughs> it turns out bergy with a dockside extortionist is pretty good pretty um mana. yeah that that adds up real quick yeah i honestly thought one of you guys were going to like deal with it <laughs> i think everybody was tapped out so unless you had like yeah. three spells. Yeah, no, that turn cycle when you like slammed Ancient Tomb and you played Bergy, I was just like, well, uh, my land comes in to play theft, and so uh, I guess <laughs> we'll do something about it. And then they... <laughs> and then realizing you could have bolted yourself when you like said. Yeah. Uh, well, I thought it was really... When it got to the Torox player's turn and he tapped his one black mana to play the Shadow Spear, I was like, oh... Okay. Yeah, I was right, a, little, well, a little worried so about that. at that point. Yeah, uh, like, well, uh, that might be GG's. <laughs> yeah. Yep. So and you then, probably, uh, you probably just you guys were... have the kill spell, which, I mean, it happens. Yeah. When you guys were counting it up, I was just like, there's no way he doesn't have it. Like. <laughs> right. Yeah, the, the only thing I was doing was, like, in my head, like, do I need Hammer of Nazan, or can I just win with him? Yeah. Like I said, I had the twin flame to get the second Yodo to go. That's the second week. I assume somebody else was going to uh, do something about it back to back. Yeah. <laughs> but I think John and it was also yeah. against me. Yeah, yeah that's what I said. Second <laughs> week, I thought somebody else was going to do something about the Yodo. And John like, <laughs> made it seem like he was going to do something, and then he was like, oh shit. <laughs> yeah. I guess I can keep that. It's not too good. Do you want to shuffle uh, turn order? Oh, yeah. We'll do it three times here. One, two, three. Hey, look at that. Slesnia at the front. I'm going to go to six. I'll take my free mode. Has anyone here played uh, the new Pokemon game? No, I've heard it's good. I'm not. It's very good. I don't. I don't own a Switch, and a long time ago I asked like a bunch of friends who like jumped on the Switch train if it was worth. I think it was like Let's Go Pikachu or whatever. If it was worth buying a Switch, and they were like, no. And then yeah, that one's that one's not the one that you want to like <laughs> mention yeah. that to. Well, and then time went on, and then I think it was like Sword and Shield came out, and I was like, is it worth buying a Switch? 
And they're like, no, not really. Like, you know, it's one game. And I was like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> and then uh, now that one's come out. And I'm like, oh. but I've been like mulling it over <clears throat> just to play with the girls alone. Like, but yeah, uh, it's, it's very fun. I really enjoyed it. I, uh, I've heard it's like really refreshing. I almost, I just have to finish completing the Pokedex, but <laughs> caught everything in it and beat the ending and all that stuff. So I just have to finish like tasks and stuff. And then shiny hunt because shinies are fun. <laughs> yeah, I pretty much only play games to like PvP yeah. aspect. <laughs> so that's the only reason why I would play is if there was like any sort of online matchmaking. Right. Uh, uh, I, that's actually, so I play Pokemon Go and I play competitively for Pokemon Go. I will keep my second seven. <clears throat> Going to five. You have a slight echo, echo of Mega Man. What's that? There's, you just have like a smidge of an echo. Just give me a heads up. I mean, it's not like I just yawned and heard myself yawn, so that's why. Oh, uh, okay. Going to six. I'm gonna go grab a cup of coffee real quick. Two. Does not hand make. Smart pitch, at least. Starting at four. 
<laughs> All right. I'm good with my five. Um, any pre-game actions? Nope. I'm going to reset your health total there, Goodo. <laughs> And playing this for something. Pass. Savannah into Avison Smallgroom. Pass. Uh, draw. Please don't. Want to play a luxury suite and enter? No. <laughs> play a mountain. Why would you think it would be okay? I'll pay, play a jeweled amulet, and I'll pay for Esper Sentinel. And then I will pass. <laughs> um, I don't know if you're playing the uh, Add nods or not, so ninja. That's fine. I'm I'm not, but it's fine. Uh, fast turn. <laughs> Man, confluence. Bring out Savala. Go ahead. Go play a pool delta. Uh, go fetch for a badlands. And I'll play a curse totem. You can draw one off the uh, what you call it. Oh, you're feeding the sentinel. <laughs> for shame. Hi, <laughs> I'm gonna turn after that. <laughs> you said you're good. Well, I guess I'll just get in the shop. What you're saying is you don't want to draw cards for Silvala? Correct. <clears throat> uh, for all you guys, that gasses you more than me. So. Is that all, was that all you're doing? I just told you I'm not playing Adnos, so I don't care that much about drawing a lot of cards. <clears throat> Alright, I'll go to my turn. I'll play another mountain. <clears throat> I will. Tap two. For cryptic trilobite, where X is one, to put a plus one plus one counter, mm -hmm. and I will pass the turn. I'll pass the turn. Tap. What's this thing? What's the card with the counter? Uh, cryptic trilobite. I can uh, remove a plus one plus one counter to add two colorless. I can only spend that mana to activate abilities. No. Such as equip costs. Uh, wing it ninja for three. Okie dokie. <clears throat> Pass the turn. Right, untap. Scroll. Play a swamp. Um. <clears throat> we'll cast Balthus. Kitty cat. Deuce, deuce, deuce. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, on your end step, I'm going to exile Simeon Spirit Guide for red to put a charge counter on uh, my jewel damage. Okay. Cool. 
Esper, because I'm a good little boy. Uh, I will tap for three, and amulet so for four. I play a Karn, great creator. That's the cursed totem one. Yeah. This is the different the different art that has all the text on it. I can't remember. Uh, he's got five to start with. Yeah, that's what I was like just trying to fucking read through. I was like, what the hell? Right. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pull. I'm gonna have to pull it up. Uh, the planeswalker before there was planeswalker text. Yeah, exactly. Uh, it's really cool, but man, it's a fucking pain to read. Um, see, so he's got five loyalty. I will. You just pull it up in spell table. It might be a little easier for you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'll just. Yeah. <clears throat> big big factor is opponent artifacts can't activate. Yeah, I'll just uptick him yep. to make mana vault a creature and then uh, pass the turn. I've legitimately never seen that card before. <laughs> It's pretty cool. It's the secret lair version of the yeah. card great creator. Oh, okay. It's cool. It's just like So it just changed the way it was, right? It's like yeah, it's like the full text lands. Okay. Basically. I was gonna say I feel it like I've seen this. It just before, has like a huge block of before. fucking text. So. Okay, gotcha. That makes more sense now. I was just I'll like, go to this card and pass the turn. Oh shit. Whoops. Let's see here. Keep paying for that S <laughs> That's what he wants. He's about to pop off. <laughs> well, being that I can't tap my creatures for mana. <clears throat> let's have them both attack Karn for three total. And oh, you didn't have a creature out. That's oh no, you do have. The I do. Player, it's right? a, just a one-one. I don't want to block. That's all I got. No, I can't really risk my for sentinel. So. <laughs> all right. I mean, you uh, can. Untap. Draw. Not if I want to turn them in. <laughs> I'm gonna play a white step pathway. <sighs> I'm going to cast. Jessica Thrice Reborn, paying the one extra for Esper. I've cast mm -hmm. two commanders, so she'll come in with two counters. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to minus one her. I'm going to shoot the Mana Vault, the Tribal Bite, and what do you have, Nate? Savella and... Addison. Just an Avis and Dolgrim. You should probably shoot the Sentinel, right? The Esper Sentinel? I, no, I'm not, not going to do that. Did, did you pay for one? I did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, I, did. Right. I mean, I think, uh, well, I guess you're trying to see if you want to stack this out a little bit. Uh, I'm going to shoot Savella. God damn it. Okay, so those are the targets? Yeah. In response to the target, I will put a plus one, plus one counter on the tribal bite. Okay, it still dies. You oh, can. And you also can. can't activate abilities because of curse yeah. turn. Oh, um, no. Yeah. You're all right. But it, it has death touch anyway, so it doesn't matter. So what's what are the targets? Uh, Trilobite, Mana Vault, and uh, Savella. I knew I should have. Anyway. I'll pass the cat in response. Okay. Here we get a basic win. So your Mana Vault will die, but your oh your Trilobite will still die. Yeah, Savella, you like pay one for Esper Sentinel for the pass? Uh, sure. 
It's a basic rate. <clears throat> I was saving that for Goto, but if you're just going to arbitrarily kill my commander... <laughs> I mean, I gotta get her tax up there. You are, Either way, you already got her locked under a cursed totem. I mean, yeah, but there's two green players that both require activating the commander. I'm certain the cursed totem is not going to stay around forever, so... <laughs> it's, the, it's the play to kill Savella. That's all I got. Yep, that's the end of my turn. Karn for one. And go to discard. Oof. Oh. <clears throat> well, attack Karn for two and Jessica for one. Averted catacombs. Let's use averted catacombs. Get ourselves a temple garden. Totem with combat damage. <laughs> yeah. Let's play Yisan, the Wandering Bard. Yep, seems good. Let's keep Cursed Totem around a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. Pass the turn. No, I don't. Uh... I'm going to cast Demonic Tutor. All right. Uh, yeah, I'll pay the one. I think I'm going to tap that differently. There you go. Um, Demonic Tutor. Mm -hmm. um, um... Step will put a charge counter on Jewel Damulet. Yep. Uh, 
pass the turn. Got there. Razor Verge Thicket comes in tapped. Are you certain you can't pay three white to untap it? Uh, what? That was, <laughs> that was a joke in regards to our last game. That I fucked up. <laughs> I didn't read the like entire text of Agadine. <laughs> it actually mattered. I put it into play tap rather than untapping it. So Oops. I was like super confused when I was like, yeah, I could have stopped that if I didn't have a tap plan. And they were like, what are you talking you know. about? <laughs> <laughs> okay, that hurts a little bit. Yeah. Oh, uh, what else? Let's get two more Salvala damage on uh, old kitty cat. Uh, I'm gonna attempt. I'm gonna pay two life. If I'm gonna take two life either way, I'm gonna attempt to dismember Salvella. Oh, you ripped her to shreds. <laughs> um, trigger rest for Sentinel. I guess I'm paying two more life. No, it, yeah, it's fine. You can draw. Okay. That's okay. Boo this man. Boo. All right, you ready? On tappy. On tappy. Draw. This is why it's okay. I'm going to cast Wheel of Fork. Oh, uh, there's still a trigger. Yeah. No, yeah, you're going to draw it and then discard it. Yep. I have to draw it. Yep. I will respond. Yippee. I will enlighten tutor. I pass, party. Do it with me. Pass. All right, artifact or enchantment. I do not have that, unfortunately. Um, the better white version. What is it called? What the fuck you could just get like a force of vigor. Oh wait, no. Uh, artifact. Oh, yeah, 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 artifact oh yeah, just disregard. Don't listen to me. I'm, I'm done. Or silence, <laughs> I think it's called. Yeah, just, yeah. your opponents for two for all their artifacts and gems, and then you can also sack it. <laughs> Card so good. It's probably like the only good white card. Mm -hmm. Get your own curse totem. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel like that would be a poor choice. <laughs> it's obviously S for something. <laughs> well, since I do not see Song of Dryads. It's in here somewhere, but I'll throw Smothering Tithe on top. Okie dokie, Artichoke. Good, good card. 
<clears throat> Alright, so we're back to Wheel of Fortune on the stack? Yeah. Uh, I'll respond now. I'll just cast a Pyretic Ritual. Because I have three red floating. Three red manias. Just in case. That's going away anyways, so... No, I get you. I was uh, just messing my, 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 I, I say really dumb things all the time. And then, uh, yeah, I'm good to resolve Wheel. Everyone else is. Alright. Uh, <laughs> I do play the reanimator, it matters. Um, I have Bergy, Mayhem, Devil, Dockside, Fracto Signet, Old Gorger Dragon, and M. Smith. Okay. Oh, uh, Gorger's in the yard. I pitched a Heat Shimmer, uh, REB, and Hammer Mizon. I had a bunch of stuff. Sack Outlet, Academy Rector, Silver Library, Silence, Even My Sister, Lands. Nice. That I just drew. <laughs> Umbral Mantle and Mirror Entity, go. Oops. Um, yeah, and then. Boy, uh. No, this, yeah. Uh, Jeweled Lotus. Uh, in response to the Jeweled Lotus. Uh, yeah. Okay. Or dual bows. Yeah. Okay. I guess I uh, uh move to combat. <laughs> Get rid of your man. Uh. I don't know if this is a good play, but I'm gonna try it. Uh, I'll use two of the red to cast a desperate ritual, holding priority on it. I'm gonna use the last red and another one to Tibbet's trickery, my own desperate ritual. Oh, gotcha. So you're going to flip into something nice. Gotcha. Okay. That's, that's the hunt. Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. So, uh, at random, so one and two will be one, three and four will be two, and five and six will be three. So I mill three. Exile three. No, it's just mill. Oh, you mill them. Mill okay. Yeah. <clears throat> I, had a, <laughs> I had a gamble, a burgie, and a salt and monolith. Oddly appropriate. And then right, exile yeah. from the top until I exile a non-land. Uh, so I'll uh, get a Brass Squire. What is it? A Brass Squire. Oh, that's the thing that helps you just equip things for free? Yep, that is correct. Gotcha. Okay. Man, this uh, turn two first totem was pretty hot. Yes, yep. it was. <laughs> um, and then I'll play my land for turn, which is Burden Catacombs. I forget my Badlands this time. Originally, I said Badlands, but then I just pulled out the uh, <laughs> Blood Crypt instead because it was easier. <laughs> and I think that'll be the end of my turn ski. Right. Oh, one, two, three, Man. <clears throat> play this tap sandstone needle. With two deficient counters on. Pay two for a fill or stone. Uh, trigger? I will pay. And, uh, yeah, I will pass my turn after that. Did yeah. I? I did. <laughs> Um, He's got one, two, three, four, five, six mana next 
turn. Are you counting me or? Oh, uh, Grodo. I have seven mana. One, two, three, that four, five, six, seven. Oh, six, there's two. one on that. Yeah, Nito's right, right. two for the depletion. Yeah. <clears throat> but don't worry, I can't equip anything because Curse Totem's there. <laughs> the way you said that was like, that's what he thinks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> totally, kind of the... totally don't worry <laughs> about it, guys. <laughs> yeah. a single red uh, spell, so. Probably like a shattering spree. It's not like red is known for artifact destruction, guys. <laughs> uh, it's not a thing. Curse um, Code doesn't stop equip, does it? No, but it stops the brass no, herald. It stops my brass herald. Ah, that's, uh, that's not, the, not that's making the, that connection. Yep, that's <laughs> the, that's the uh, point. The secret sauce. Anything else out of Safi? Yeah. <clears throat> um, so Chromox, I'm printing a, whoops, that was the wrong card. Sorry. Printing a prismatic ending. Wait, I didn't see what card it was. Nobody needs to know anything. <laughs> oh, what was it you imprinted? Prismatic ending. Okay. <clears throat> and uh, that'll be my turn. It's best. Okay. Let's play ourselves a forest. Or play the smothering tithe. Mm -hmm. Yep, so there's a pretty good. I'll trigger your rest for signal. Pay for it. Um, Pay for it. Pay for it. Do it. Do it. Pay for it. Hell yeah, brother. Unless it's a dire need to keep that mana open, you pay for it. Chicken, look at what? Salvala is dead. No, we ain't turn that back on. And I will end my turn. All my friends are dead. Push me to the edge. <laughs> 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 uh, uh, at the end of your turn, I'm going to cast Vampiric Tutor, playing for S for Uh-oh. I'll respawn by fetching. Yes. Man, it would have been nice to have that even Mind Sensor right now. Whoops. <laughs> <clears throat> this looks disturbingly like a World Gorger loop about to happen. <gasps> oh, it. Net. Just flying around. Uh, what? Oppo. Just flying around Oppo. I don't think he's going to. He don't have the mana for it, but yeah. He did. You never know. There could be a dark red. Yeah, uh, true. Uh, I can search. Yep. Yeah. All right, guys, let's not lose to a World Gorger combo. <laughs> that is accurate. So we can lose to a Goto? I mean, you know. That would be okay. It would get rid of Curse Totem for you guys. <laughs> Just kill the dragon. Uh, Start on top. Go to untap step. Mm -hmm. Go to draw. 
Yeah, smothering tide trigger. Uh, Pay the tithe. You know what? Yo, let's swag for 20 points. Pays the tithe. Um, We've been pretty wait, good about paying our taxes this game. We really yeah. have. <laughs> I'm proud of everybody. Canyon Swath. I'm disappointed in all of you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go for it here. Uh, animate dead, targeting world order bully. I pass. I let me double check. I pass priority on. Ooh, okay, let me look here. <clears throat> or I pass priority on the cast and target of animate dead. If you're wanting to kill it. You wait till it ETBs and kill it with the ETB trigger on the stack. Yes. Yeah. You have to know. So, Safi? Alright, so yeah. I'll allow it, or I have no response to the cast. Does anyone have a response to the cast? No response to animate dead cast. Yeah. Okay, uh, so ETB? Normal. ETB trigger? ETB, yep, I, uh, I have no effects for ETB trigger. Okay, so ETB trigger, I'll cast a beast with them. Targeting enemy dead. No, target the dragon. Yeah, you, target, you have to target, it. target the dragon. Targeting the dragon. Yeah, yeah. right, sorry. Uh, responses. I do not respond to beast within. Uh, to Bolt's trickery. Targeting beast within. I have no response to Tibble's trickery. <sighs> All right. Yep, uh, no response to it. You might rip into something with the Bolt's trickery, though. But... Yeah, that's. So, uh, Safi or Savala gets a. Uh, do you have a response to Tibbolts? Yeah, do you have a response to Tibbolts. Okay, so we can move to Resolve so Tibbolts. Uh, it's so we can... random, so you, no, have no, no, roll, it's random. you have to roll. Yeah. So... Oh, roll, okay. Yeah. But I roll a d6. Yeah, yeah. d6. Yeah. Okay. What you roll is what you would know, one, two, or three. Three. No three. three. Yep. Oh, three. Calamaya. Widow's Bodell's. Ox Amber. And then now Same. you exile and throw you reveal. Oh. Is that a path? Yeah, yep. but it's got to be a non land. It's got to be a non land, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, so it's got to be a permanent. Her. It has to be a permanent. Permanent, no. yeah. Oh, gotcha. No, wait. No, it doesn't. Devaults is until they exile a non land card with a different name. Yeah, it, he's right. It's a it path. Oh, yeah, it. it is. Okay. Oh, yeah, so I did reveal the path. path. For free. He can I did reveal the this card as well. What do you guys want? You guys want to yeah, second leave, leave it on top. It's, really good. Okay. it's just, yeah. Wow. All right. Um, so, path, wow. Path, the world of Georgia. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my wow. god. What I mean, a fucking rip. That's kind of, that's the way it works sometimes. That it, is... do, it do be like that sometimes. Yeah, these are all cool. Wow. You do get a land. But then, I, does the land get eaten by Gorger too? Yeah, because it would yeah. buy the ETB. Yeah. Um, but I can oh. I I will get a land though, and I'll float mana in my mana pool and crack the jeweled woes. Uh, right. Yeah. You have a fucking rip. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's insane. <laughs> I mean, that's the way it works. Uh -oh. World Order is very much like uh, all in or nothing. Yeah, it's it's kind of like Thassa's Oracle. If they yeah. got the answer, it's a blowout. But if if they don't, you just win the game. Yeah. <clears throat> but Thassa's is a little bit more forgiving because you still have a board state. Yeah. Yeah, but usually you don't have enough of a deck. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and what what did you get? What mana with the jeweled? Black uh, or red? What? Did you get black or red mana? Wait, it doesn't matter. I can't cast anything. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm one away. Right. <clears throat> Here you go. Oh, untap, oh, keep drawing. Hopefully, <clears throat> everybody blew all their answers on that, and I can win. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it is usually the second person yep. to go for combo that yeah, wins. Yeah, so I will go with the City of Traders. You get another uh, Smothering Tie trigger there. Uh, ah, yes. Mm, let me... Let me Wait, let me count my mana real quick. Let's 
seven. Just to be safe, I will pay the two. Just in case you have a path. Okay. I mean, now that the Gorger has eaten the cursed totem, Avison's Pilgrim's online. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, he also has Brass Herald, too, so that's kind of worse. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I will move it to Push Encounter. And. Spell Warstone. I'll three red. I'll play the City of Traders. I'll use the three red for a seething song to go to five red. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll use five and six for Gota. Okay. Yep. ETB Gota. He goes and fishes uh, equipment. I happen to uh, pass priority. Okay. <laughs> um, I actually, I'll, I'll, I have a response. Um, okay. A response to the goto yeah before yeah before you uh, shuffle the search or before search? i will yeah okay i will mill the top card of your library so ruby, <laughs> ruby <Medina. Damn. laughs> a civala do you pass priority i pass priority on goto okay i mean it wasn't a bad play considering you ripped the path yeah i mean yeah. Shit, dude you fucking could have <laughs> be hilarious <laughs> Two, double, double twice, fucking Yu Gi Oh! <laughs> Hot of the cards. Okay, I was looking to see if it was the second from the top, because then it would have been really funny. That would have been intense. I disagree. <laughs> I it was all the way on the bottom. Uh, grab Helm of the Host. Ah, uh, damn. It does not say mill the bottom card. No. <laughs> oh, rats. I'll tap Brassquire to attempt to equip Helm of the Host. Response to Brassquire? Yep, I have no response. I'm gonna evoke a Solitude and exile Godo. Woo! Alright, yep, Godo is exiled. Back to the command zone. Wait, what happened to Godo? He got exiled. From what? Solitude. Evoking Solitude. Oh. <laughs> you do uh, gain three life. Oh, I do. So you're saying there's still a chance. So you're saying <laughs> there's a chance. Uh, I will play this. Uh, oh, no, I can't play that. Uh, <clears throat> Man, I should have killed that Esper Sentinel. I'll tap one. I'll play a. <laughs> I'll play, I'll play an expedition map, and uh, I'll go ahead and crack it now to go find a land to put in my hand. And then, uh, yeah, I don't have anything else, so I'll have to pass my turn. All right, I'm gonna search for the land. Would you care to pay the tithe? Um, let's see here. <clears throat> I will pay the tithe. Mm. Very, very also good at paying our taxes this game. I'm grabbing a, a buried ruin and I land off of Expedition Map. Uh, Brett, so you know, in case uh, you didn't at the time, the the reason why you target the dragon is so it exiles all my permanents rather than animate that would just go to the yard. Right, right, yeah. And I'll uh, cast Sappy. And then pass the turn. Okay. <clears throat> so we've got Fairy Ruin that can get it back if it gets killed. You've got enough mana to recast Goto over there, right? Correct. I believe so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have exact seeds right now to recast.
Yeah, if you guys could just like prevent each other from stop winning for like, you know, 20 more turns. <laughs> <laughs> I would legitimately don't play Adnos, by the way. Is like in, in any of your black decks? No. Okay. I just don't. I don't like uh, the entire idea of just like turbo, right? Like those glass yeah. and like fragile builds. I don't like decks that are like that. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, it's still a great card draw spell, mm -hmm. depending on how much you're, you know, the CMC of your deck. But yeah, if you have yeah, like, low, yeah, if you have low CMC, then like Adnos is good. If you're high, then I think you just run Pier into the Abyss for like the same effect, yeah. basically. I have both the cards. I just don't right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enjoy either. <laughs> Uh, when I fish gold, goldfish the deck, it, it just feels like it just doesn't add anything. Like mm -hmm. the deck doesn't generate enough mana without like in some sort of infinite loop. Right. That even if I draw all those cards, I'm going to discard down to seven anyways. Right. Problem is we've got Safi out there as well, so even stopping Goto is not <clears throat> quite enough here. Alright, well, we we try stupid shenanigans then. I always thought the rule was if you can't prevent them from winning, you win the game. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Five. Let's get Salvala back in the game. They won for Concordant Crossroads. Hey, it's still some cards. Whee! And then I think it's time to parlay! Hell yeah, brother. Uh, I have a Goblin I Engineer. I have to reveal it. It's a line that I have. Goblin Engineer. Would you get Safi? Where's my great stuff? Okay, so that's three. Would any of you care to pay for the tithe? No. I cannot, so. That'll be three green mana and three treasures. Activate Yisan with the three green mana. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> he gets a verse counter. We'll grab the Quirion Ranger. Mm -hmm. Uh, I can untap once at the moment. Okay. Because Quarian Ranger is a once per turn. <laughs> oh, right, right. <clears throat> uh, let's use up the three treasures to play Congregation at Dawn. It is a triple worldly tutor. Okay. Good for me. Yep. You're good.
We get Wirewood Symbiote, Scrib Ranger, and Ashaya Soul of the Wild. I think that gets you there, doesn't it? That does indeed establish an infinite loop. And then what, you use that to mill us out? Wait, uh, let me look at the, each of those here. What, um... I mean, at any point, any one of you can interact and kill the combo. Yeah. Assuming you have any way to interact. I do. Then, so those are then not... we're certainly not there yet. I'll so those are on the top of your library, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, how much mana do you have right now? Any? Currently? I have none in the pool. Zero. Okay. I mean, I'm I'm thinking killing Silvala is the one way to stop it, right? No, oh, killing Silvala is definitely a way to kill off the combo. What was, what's the third <laughs> card um, that you're... Ashaya. Ashaya? Yeah. He's got Wirewood, Scrib Ranger, and Ashaya, which, and with that in Query and Ranger, he's able to basically bounce. How do you, how do you spell that? A-S-H... A-S-H... Okay. Okay. <clears throat> All right. All right. Yep, continue. Okay. Well, I will activate Query and Ranger, bouncing my Savannah to untap Salvala. I've got a response for that trigger. Okay. Korean, I will, Korean ability on the stack. Yep. I will sacrifice Safi to all hero dementia to have the top two cards of your library build. Oh, nice. Firewood and Scrib go into the yard. Any other responses? No. Nope. None for me. I'm pretty sure okay. that stops the loop as well. Megaphone. Yeah. Well. Parlay! Oh look, it's a Shia. I have a Rite of Flame. Calling Cavern of Souls. And what do you got, Ninja? Calling the Week. Okay, so that's three. Anybody paying their uh, taxes? Do not have the mana. Nope. So you got three green and three treasure. Three. Let's use one of the treasure and two of the green to play a recruiter of the guard. Good for me. Yep. You're good. That's better. Grabbing. Eternal Witness. Mm-hmm. Yep. Use the two remaining treasures, the one remaining green in the pool. Play Eternal Witness. I 
and target. Get back. Target the wirewood symbiote. Okay. It's good for me. Is there, you have no other land or mana open, right? I currently show no mana. Okay. Play Savannah as my land for the turn. Play Wirewood Symbiote. Use Wirewood Symbiote to bounce the Quirion Ranger to untap Salvala. Yep. Salvala hey, Parlays. Uh, I have a land. Priest. Oh, we're shooting there. What did you get, Faultus? Dothy Voidwalker. Voidwalker, okay, so. Three mana, three treasures. Uh, let's see here. Play Korean Ranger again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Use the three treasures and two green floating to play a Shia. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then this lets you loot because you can bounce the symbiote because it's a forest. Uh, well, the Ranger can just bounce itself as right. a forest. Yeah. But um, we're still not there yet because I'm going to keep giving people cards to use. Yep. And I don't have a silence effect in place yet. So we have the ranger bounce itself to untap Salvala. Yep. And then we can parlay. A chaos Man. orb. Chaos Sorry. Orb. Three and three again. Man. So you basically get five mana each time you do this. Uh, Depending on what Salvala hits, yes. Okay. So, Ranger comes back. Yep. Parlay again. Oh. Bounce. Yep, bounce the Ranger. Parlay again. Marlin. Cursed Mirror. Uh, Cabal Rekko. <clears throat> Six treasures. That'll get me four. Yeah, well, this time. Uh, let's see here. I'll play the Quirion Ranger. The Ranger will bounce itself to untap Yisan this time. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then I'm assuming you do that enough and get like Ranger Captain. Yeah. And then you silence out the board. Uh, yes. And then mill all of us and pass turn. Or do you mill or, uh, or basically well, have us draw our decks. So if Allah draws you out, or I have finale of devastation for a thousand. Okay. I am, I am good to concede at this point. Uh, if anyone else has. Uh, I think I'd have to rip like something amazing. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't believe I have yeah, any, like free. There's a couple things I could hit that 
I could interrupt this with, but... Um, yeah, we're not going to get that. a chance because he has enough mana right now to activate the Yisan twice to get yeah, the Ranger. Yeah, I'm going to do Yisan so twice. So it's no essentially what we have in our hands is what we have right now to interact. Oh, he, oh, he can untap, right. He can untap yeah, because he can replay the Korean Ranger yeah. one more time and uh, activate Yisan once more. So I can go get a two drop yeah, and then go get here. a three drop. Yep. <clears throat> I'm good with it if everyone else is. I am. Sylvala and her demented paths to victory. Yep. Yeah, I didn't have any. I don't have any free, free mana. What a game. That was crazy. I came assume to, Goto, came down to the third Goto and Safi both had the win on their next turn. Huh? I assume you were going to be able to Take it next turn, Goto and Snaffy. Yeah, unless someone killed Goto again. That was going to be the only... Uh... Now Brett's never going to be able to cut Path X out, because he's going to be like, there was that one time. <laughs> that was <laughs> awesome. Path's just too good not to have. I didn't, think you had, I didn't think you had the Solitude, which is unfortunate. I had Song of Dryads in my hand, which could have turned your hat into a free but that would have just blocked you out and given it to Safi because I didn't have any responses for the sacrifice loop that was definitely going to be happening yeah, yeah that's where I was at I could have interrupted you earlier um, Nate but it was a nature's claim which is what I needed to save me from Goto so ah. <clears throat> could have cut off the uh, smothering mana or the haste Mm -hmm. Or well, yeah, that that too. It, it would have just been home, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's why I went and got buried ruin because I figured it was helm out on the board. Someone's gonna try to blow it up. Yep. So I was like, well, I gotta get <laughs> something. Yep. That or that or using my recruiter of the guard for a rex sage to blow up the hat. Yeah, definitely a roller coaster of a game with three attempted wins. <laughs> three one, very close. Yeah, <laughs> one successful. Well, GG's, everybody. It was fun playing.